She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her Hey everybody and welcome to it. So today we're going to be transforming my car. Um, I just got this new 2021 Jeep Cherokee about a week ago so I ordered a bunch of stuff to kind of customize it and make it feel like it's my own because since it's a brand new car from the factory it kind of just feels like it's not really mine so I wanted to do some things to make it feel like home. I don't know. <laughs> there must be something bad features you find the beauty goes much deeper so we're gonna start with putting down this like seat cover thing for the back that is supposed to keep my dog Luna like off of the leather so that she doesn't scratch it all up. So we're just gonna do that. I'm gonna do a little time lapse because I'm in a rush, but yeah, okay. <laughs> She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something that features You'll find a Alright, so I got the base of it up, but I don't really know what all these extra straps are for So time to figure that out Oh wait, these are like... This is a seat belt for Luna Ha! Okay Okay, I think I got it in pretty good. My only concern is this part. I think she's gonna climb up right over and jump over just because of the way our seats are, but I don't know, we'll see. Okay, so here are some of the things I got. Um, this was the car hammock thing for Luna. This is like a big emergency kit. I'll show you what's on it. Um, here is a little rhinestone thing to go around my button, like my start button on the Jeep. This is a little car trash can. And these are some coasters, which you'll see when I put them in. Also, I will link everything below if you find something that you're interested in. Anyway, so this is like just like a big roadside emergency kit. So we have some jumper cables. This little like tow rope thing. Comes with a little flashlight. Um, some little those things. <laughs> this thing to put more tire air in my tires. Some gloves. This is like a wrench with a bunch of stuff on it. Um, the zipper already fell off the other side so it's broken this is like a like triangle that is like a reflector for if i ever like get stuck on the side of the road in the nighttime um a vest some tape insulating tape oh this is like a window smasher that i'm gonna put in the front and then here it's like a first aid kit with like band-aids and stuff if i actually ever get hurt okay here's the trash can just gonna get it a little figured out Okay, it's not the most sturdiest thing, but it'll work. Um, it has this little like thing right here to put trash in and stuff on the sides and it can hook around to wherever I want. Okay, well just now, Amazon stopped by and brought me this trunk organizer, but I just remembered that I have a bunch of like boxes of all my goal books in the back, so I don't know if I'll be able to put that back there, but we'll try. First, I brought a mask because there have been a couple times where I like used to have a bunch of masks in my other car and now I don't and I go somewhere and then I realize I forgot my mask so I wanted to put an extra one in there. Next, let's take a look at these coasters. I really hope they fit. If not, that'd be tough. So here are two of them. They're really cute, just black and white. Um, basic ones off of Amazon. Then these ones, and there's two other ones, but these are the ones I'm gonna have up front. I like this one the most. Oh, they're a little small. Oh well, that's okay. Dang it. Oh well, we tried. These ones down there kind of fit. Next, I have this absolutely adorable little rainbow beaded thing that I'm gonna hang from my little mirror up here. This was sent to me in my P.O. box. I will link the shop below. It's just so cute. I love the colors. Cute! <laughs> okay, so now I need a spot for the car trash can, but my only options are on the back of these seat heads, which is where Luna's little doggy thing is, and I'm afraid she would get into it. Um, on the side, down here, but that doesn't leave shotgun riders with much leg room, or back here. So I think I'm gonna try and put it back here and see how that works. <laughs> 
Okay. So here's what it's looking like. Um, since it goes like down through here, it's having a little bit of a tough time when I close this, but that's okay. That's the only way it's gonna work. <laughs> so I'm gonna put my little window breaker over here. Or would it be smarter to put it in here, maybe? Put it in there. Now let's open up this thing and see if it'll actually fit on my button. That's what it looks like. It has like stuff on the outside, so I don't know if it's bad to cover that. Okay, so it did cover up those words. Um, I will not lie, I accidentally just dropped it and it fell between the seats and now I can't find it, but yeah. <laughs> like it fell down here. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know about this. Okay, giving up on that for now. So now we're gonna go to the back and see if we can fit the stuff in the trunk. Okay, so I think that this should be able to just tuck in right there, which is perfect. Yeah, I do have a lot of boxes, but I think there's like a little space right there that it might be able to fit in. I mean, yeah. Ooh. Okay, I got it. It looks good. I really don't have anything to put in there right now. I mean, we could stick this umbrella, I guess. <laughs> It'll come in handy soon, I'm sure. My only thing is that it's looking a little cluttered with like all these things around the headrest. <laughs> um, but I have to have that little car seat thing for Luna so she doesn't scratch up the leather, so can't want to do much about it. I also just found this Bath and Body Works like little car scentsy thing and it has the smell of champagne toast in it right now. So I'm gonna put it in my car. Right now my car does have like the new car smell, um, but obviously that's not gonna last forever and when it stops smelling like the new car, um, I'd rather it smell like champagne toast rather than, I don't know, a mix of like McDonald's and snow and I don't know, okay? <laughs> so I'm gonna put this up now. Yay! So far I have a pretty nice vibe in here with like black and whites, um, then there's the rainbow, but then other than that everything else is pretty good. Same color theme. There also are some things on Amazon that I saw that I really want to get, um, and that's like, there's like these little accents on the front of the Jeep that are currently like silver and I would like them to be black because I like the black details. Um, so I think I'm gonna order those. Then I also ordered weatherproof mats to go like on the ground so that with all the snow coming in, um, it will like dry on that rather than into these nicer mats. So excited about that as well. Anyways, we're not done yet though. Today I need to go through the car wash because part of this video, I bought a car wash pass last night. It's basically like an ultimate unlimited package where I can go through the car wash as many times as I want. So that's super fun and it's really nice for the winter because my car gets really dirty since it's white. So I'm excited about that and I just went last night but I wanna go again for this video and show you all because it's so cool. It gets your car so warm, so clean and it also like smells really good. So obviously you can't smell through the camera but I just wanted to take you guys the car wash. I thought that'd be fun. So yeah, we will go do that and then I also have to go to the gas station and get gas because I'm almost out. But yeah, let's go ahead and do that. These are the things that I was talking about, if you can see. But it looks like they only go 2014 to 2018 and I would need 2021. Fun fact, this is my first time ever putting gas in this car because I filled it up at the station when I first bought it. Alright, so we're here at the car wash. Um, I've never seen a line this long for a car wash, but that's alright, we're gonna stick through it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Told my brothers one day we gon' make it. We just gotta grind for that paycheck. Mama told me one day I'll be famous. Remember when she used to say she hate this Bad ended with life when I say Now I'm inside all them people's playlists So one day I'll be stopping Update! I ordered a bunch more stuff for my car So I will finish this vlog in a couple weeks And then that all comes in So see ya then <laughs> Hello, we have a lot to catch up on. So it is currently the day that I was going to go get my new tire rims that are like black and my floor mats, which I am currently on my way back. 
I was planning on vlogging on the way there and while I was there, um, but we had some interruptions and difficulties that I will inform you about right now. Um, so I actually got pulled over for the first time ever. I've never gotten pulled over. I've never had any tickets. I've never gotten any accidents in my whole four years of driving and having my license. And I finally just got pulled over. I was so sad and nervous because like I've literally never been pulled over like even like talk to a cop. But it ended up being all right. I ended up getting a ticket. So anyways, I drove an hour to the car place. The place that I go to, I will tell you the name because they're so awesome and I want to give them some business if you guys are ever looking for any cars. Um, it's called High Day. Um, I'll put the exact name right here. It's pretty long. It's up in Bluffton, Indiana. They are so nice, so like, they work so well with you to make sure that you're super happy with your car. Anyways, they're amazing. So I drove an hour to go there to get my new wheel because I ordered new rims that are all black for the car so that it would look pretty sick. But yeah, I just wanted to keep you updated because this is part of like the- ah! Bye. It's part of this whole customization video and I will show you what it all looks like when I get back. <laughs> I need to put on all these stickers and put a couple last minute things in the car itself. I got a ice scraper because I had been borrowing my boyfriend's this whole time, so I got a nice gray one to keep back there. I bought a big thing of disposable black masks to keep in my car for whenever I forget a mask on the go. Okay, just after doing one sticker, it actually took a lot longer than I thought, so I'm going to wait and finish this tomorrow. Okay, last day of adding things to my car. Just got a lot of fun stuff in the mail, including a license plate cover, which we're going to put on first, so let's go do that. This is what it looks like. It's floral and cute, matches my vibe. I also got this pack of air fresheners from Altered State, and they just hang from your mirror, so I think I'll put this up there too and make it smell good. All right, license plate is on. Obviously not gonna show it to you because I don't wanna have to censor it out. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> also, I don't remember if I showed you, but I have this new like key fob thing and then hand sanitizer that I got from Altered State. And then from Amazon, I have these little things. So they basically stick in your vents and they hold your sauces whenever you go through a drive-thru. And wow, these things are actually pretty sturdy. I was a little nervous that they wouldn't be like good for holding things, but the, wow, that's perfect. I think for now, I'm not just gonna like constantly keep them there. I'm gonna put them in here so that I can actually use them when I am actually having sauces so that they're not just constantly up there and ruining my aesthetic, I guess. <laughs> Okay, and then my one almost last thing is this. It's so simple, but I think it'll make things look so much better. Um, it's an iPhone charger, because I have to use this to be able to connect my phone to my CarPlay, like my Apple CarPlay th stuff. So, this one, I just got off Amazon. It's like the Amazon Basics black one, because right now, if you see, the one that I have in here is this ugly neon green one, and it's ruining the vibe. So we're taking that out and just putting in this plain black one so that things look cohesive. Ah, I'm stuck. Also, all of the grill cover things came in a different day, so my dad helped me put those on one weekend that I went home. So here we are, cool little time lapse of putting all those on. He put on the tape and then I stuck it on and pushed it on there. Um, and then later on, we also put on the rest of the black accent stickers, which you will see soon. Okay. 
Okay, and then there's one last thing that I ordered for my car, but I, it's not going to be included in this video because it's being mailed to me and it hasn't even shipped yet, so I don't want to wait that long to post this video. Um, basically though, it's like a sticker for the inside of the Jeep, so like the steering rail right here, and it's going to be in the Dalmatian print at the bottom, so right there. Again, remember, everything is going to be linked below in the description if you want to shop from any of this. But I think that is going to be it for this video, so thank you so much for following along this, like, two-week process of decorating my car. <laughs> and I'll see you again in my next video. Bye!